to all of my LinkedIn network family and folks that uh, may be watching this video today that I may not be connected with yet, and I sure hope that we can connect. Uh, feel free to reach out to me. I wanted to talk to you about something today that's uh, heavy on my heart, and I need your help. Uh, some of you know, but not all of you, that uh, I do have a nonprofit organization, uh, NGO, called in uh, other parts of the, of the world. And in that nonprofit organization, I have a few orphanages that are under my care. As uh, again, some of you may know, I have been a pastor for many years, and uh, part of my ministry is uh, is reaching out to people around the world uh, in more ways than just videos here on LinkedIn. Um, there are a lot of difficulties, of course, around the world with everybody, and. One of, uh, one of my directors at our location in Nairobi, Kenya, in Africa. Um, we're, we've been struggling with providing for the kids and we're having kids that are facing starvation right now. We haven't had food for uh, a couple of weeks at our, our main orphanage in Kisi. Uh, that's in Kenya as well. And then also in Nairobi. And uh, the director of our uh, Nairobi work, is um, his name's Isaac and uh, his wife, is uh, named Edna. Here's her picture. Um, you'll see her here. And she is uh, 28. She was. She passed away and died on um, Friday evening. And um, she died as a result of uh, uh, injuries from uh, basically malnourishment and overwork. Uh, she was stressed out and had a bad bleeding ulcer and bled out and wasn't uh, able to be saved. Uh, due to coronavirus, now there is a 48 hour mandatory turnaround time on the burial of the body uh, of Isaac's wife. And um, with the costs of the hospital, with the costs of the morgue, with the costs of a casket and costs of transportation collectively, uh, I need to raise 800 US dollars today, now. So. Uh, I know it's a difficult time, it is for a lot of people, and I know it's a big question uh, to ask, but if you would be so willing to help, I need the help immediately, not like stop and think about it or come back next day and don't forget, I have to have it now because we have to come up with the money to pay the bill to get her buried, or the dollar amount will continue to increase, fines, it's, it's a mess. Um, not to mention that our children at both orphanages are starving to death. We have over, uh, well, about 50 plus combined with the two orphanages together. So anything above or beyond the 800 will go to food for the children at this moment. Um, again, I know it's a big ask and uh, you know, there's a lot going on. And I hope you all at this point know my heart and understand what's happening here. Now, if you'd like to give, uh, you could do it two ways. One, you can go to my my main website for my movement, God's Got This. And you can go to godsgotthis.love, right here, godsgotthis.love, and uh, click on donations or godsgotthis.love backslash donations. Uh, you can also go to my main website at mattcrump.tv. On the upper right-hand corner, you'll see a, a little link that says donations, same link, two different sites, whichever is best for you, godsgotthis.love or mattcrump.tv. Click donations, any amount be. be gratefully appreciated. All right, so obviously if you're in the United States, uh, you can get a tax write-off because it is a, a nonprofit organization and I will provide that should you desire. Um, however, you just wanna to give to give, feel free to do that too. All right, I need your help. Let's make a difference. Let's, uh, let's help Isaac put his wife to rest and uh, let's feed some kids and you can be a part of making something happen in the world that would make a difference right now today. It would be a massive, massive blessing. I've taken enough of your time. Thank you so much for tuning in today on Sunrise Sunday. I promise it'll be better news this week. It's my intention, but I had to share this video right now. I need your help. Thank you for being a part. Please give generously. God bless you.